This is match number two, representing the United States of America, Colin Morikawa. <laughs> representing Europe, Victor Hovland. the USA. Colin hitting driver off the first, pulls it left. Fans cheering. Got a hit, looks like he was left off the crowd, almost went back into it. Three one. For Hovland. Absolutely dead center. Three wonderful shots we've seen so far from the Europeans to start their day. This. Back down to the action at the first with Victor Hovland. 159. Up the hill, nine iron. Victor. Safe. Best you can say for that one. Looks like he's in a you know a little hay basket there of like where you would find some chicken eggs. You really wouldn't find a golf ball, but that's looks like where he is. He's been lucky, right? One of the, one of the real main things this week is reading lies. I mean, the rough is really really thick, but it's also very inconsistent and all over the golf course. So. These players and caddies have to spend a lot of time figuring out what is this ball going to do? Is it going to shoot, come up low, come off left, come up fast? It's a real challenge for these players. This is a back pin. He can't, he cannot hope for a flyer and hit it over the green. He would be in just an awful position compared to where Victor is. Dust flying up after he hit it tells you how dry it is. Wow, great shot. Great shot from Colin. What a response after that drive. Boy, I really like his look. He's giving me a couple of little breaks on this one. It's going to snake its way up to the hole. Put it all into the computer. The golfing brain. Feel the speed. Hard to get the ball to the hole when you're nervous from this range up a hill. If he gets it there, he's in control. Come on. Oh my goodness. Well, I think we safely can say he's in control of his emotions right now. Might change throughout the day. Sterling start from the Norwegian. We move up some 450 yards. Morikawa sizing this one up, Hunter. Calling from 10 feet. Struggled on the greens this week. This would really give him a boost, I think. To pour this one in, in the hole. Get one up on Victor. Get some red on that board right away. Let all the players on the range, on the tee box, see that. Just to see it, right? To visually see the U.S. leading in a match could be proved to be so strong right now. Victor with the puck hey! running down the hill. Oh, just nice, right. Didn't see that coming. It's good. We're going to go to two. That's good. No confidence on the green. Scheffler. Hovland. He has confidence off the tee. Having the week of his life. Took it down the right half. Wasn't sure if he could fly the bunker. He will have done. And that is in position A1. So we're just going to go over the right edge of that middle fairway bunker that sticks out in the middle of this fairway. It's going a little bit left. It's going to have to easy. Boy. 
The difference between that first cut and the second is is quite large. 176 for Victor Holland. Tate on the front left. He's got a tiny little back step long. He probably wants to lend this all the way to the hole. You don't want to be short and let it fall off the front edge. Flies it just past it. Right into that slope. It's going to stop. Might roll back there. No, it's going to sit. Great shot. Another great angle for Colin. A lie. It should help him turn the ball from right to left, but he's gone the other way. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Oh, great for line, not quite for distance. Call Marikawa. 25 feet up and over a mound. You can kind of see the color change right about here. It's going to go downhill into the hole. It's a break. Just a little bit too much speed there. Not that it come from Victor Hovland from the other side, though. Hovland left to right down the hill on two to win the hole. Good pace on it. Give away from Ram there. As you mentioned, Morikawa. Nothing's easy. Ryder Cup Sunday. No problem though. He's got majors in the tank. Plenty of confidence to go with it. All tied up. Some of the young star. Drop back to the third driver out for Morikawa. Aggressive play. Wrong choice. I fancy through the fairway steady. Flurin <laughs> is putting, just starts to build, doesn't it? As we see Hovland, the green is empty. Like how I'm missing the surface. Can we take advantage. Oh, you bet he can. Puts the hammer down there, Hovland. And he looks awkward, Scheffler, on the greens. They still in the hole, back at the third for Victor Hovland. You can see the marker still down for the USA. They're going to have to put it in their pocket. He goes one up. Walk earlier, why don't you? Walk earlier. Three steps before it went in. Margins appearing early on here in the Sunday singles. Hovland to win the hole here on the fourth. For a bar. Get out! Yes, absolute dead centre. And that is exactly the start Luke Donald would want. the time to put the foot down momentum gained once more at the pedal to the floor go over the jugular play for a seismic win Hovland three wood needs to rip it 275 the front oh it's good it's more than good it's great Victor he's on the fifth this week hasn't he Hovland here after again another incredible tee shot on five to win the hole. This should just move a bit left to right across this slope at the back of the green. So good to hear. Well, you let us down, Victor. Can't believe it. A 5-3. What a T-shirt. The aforementioned birdie putt of Morikawa. Back at the fifth to tie the hole with Victor Hovland. Desperate times already for Team USA. These just simply have to find the bottom of the cup. pins up to the sixth though and uh, Morikawa's second unmistakable rhythm Colin Morikawa 
I bleed this one in from the left to right. Short needs to hang on. Oh dear. This will get cheered all the way. Oh, that's not the hole he was aiming for. So Marikawa off the front of the green at six. Now Hovland's turn. Yeah, great shot there. You're expecting that one to be a few. It's Morikawa's third shot up the hill. Not much green to work with here. And that is going to come right back to where he is. And sit even worse on a even steeper downslope. For this pretty much needs to drop for Morikawa at six. After a few attempts from down there. The effectors just put the screw on him for early doors and put him under so much pressure. I think it might be conceded. Yes, it has been. It is three up to Europe in match number two. Look at Shane Knight, the caddy of Victor Hovland getting the crowd going. They want more of that today. It's best not to rip the lip read. Tyrrell Hatton oh, over to Hovland. Is this straight at it at seven? Oh. Over to the much quieter seventh tee for now at least. Morikawa. USA! Hovland stayed up on the precipice of the tier. It's a great looking shot here. Towering. Oh, this could be very good. This could be very, very good. Oh, what a shot. Such a good iron player. Brilliant shot in there for Morikawa. Good use it. He's three down in that mat. A couple of slopes, though, for Hovland at seven. Yeah, you can see the different colours of the grass. He's sort of slightly uphill into the grain, then straight down grain. You've got to think he's got to hold this for the, half, uh, for the tie, though. See how warm it is out there. I mean... These young, fit guys, you know, and the, the sweat, it must be so hot, the pressure. But he's as cool as a cucumber. Great to, to follow to follow on from Morikawa's uh, tee shot there. Fantastic. Morikawa. That's a fantastic response, knowing that Morikawa's in close, and he's got to hold that and keep keep ahead, not let the door open at all. That's a brilliant putt, that is. You Such can see how severe moment. it is. Just a, a, a. And now the pendulum of pressure turns to Morikawa. This to tie. Yep. Two birdies. One to the eighth. Good Most job. important shot now is hit this fairway. Hov the putter in his hand just now. Back on the tee, Hovland. Like you said, Stevie, really important drive here. Oh, wow. Four right! Four right! Four! Well, we know Get where that's going. Oh, that is, that's a it's long, long, long way right. I think he's got a break there, though, Beef. I think it hit the path and then it's off. Second for Morikawa. Long way in here. Two eight. Uh, I mean, how good is that? From 227 yards. Big high fade. How good is that? Start the left of the pin. High cut. Land it soft. Pin high. Hovland's third shot after he laid up here on the eighth. Really good there. Morikawa's going to have a cut for the win, but Hovland's put him under a bit of pressure there. Very clever course management there. To the eighth green for Birdie. Such a, a fabulous shot to hear for Morikawa. To eat into the margin. 
that would have been some that would have been some three with a fairway wood. But it just shows you Hovland's uh, game plan there and his course management has given him a chance with a tie. Plenty from Norway as well. As we see Victor Hovland trying to tie the hole, keep that three up margin. See if his strategy works here. Marikawa's four was good enough in the end, it was a great four. Back to two up, fine, fine margins. It's Hovland's second shot here, 278, iron out. He's trying to hit a big draw around this tree. And it's hopped out of the rough, which is which is going to be a lot more helpful than... Right there, over to Morikawa, second at nine. Oh, Swing, bro. <laughs> yeah, again, like we said, anywhere around that front edge is a good place to be after... So Fitzpatrick keeps his one-up margin. Back to the third of Hovland. You like to say, Beefy just jumped out of the rough here. Oh, that's a su sublime shot. I don't think he'd have been able to play that shot if it didn't help out that second cut. No way, absolutely not. I mean, you can get covering the ball from where he was. If he's, if it stays in the thicker rough, you know, he's got to try and play like a bump and run up. But I mean, you still got to hit the shot and to hit it to a foot. Outrageous, to be honest. Second shot ahead of Morikawa. From the rough, though, at 10. 184. Boy, I don't think referees have no idea what these players are going to be able to get out of there. The pin on the left side, it's going to be hard for him to get anywhere near it. Stay, stay. Obviously, it's not going to stay, but we're hoping at this point. But pretty darn good shot out of the rough to get it just short of the green with his uh, pitching ability. Should be okay. I've seen that all week, that left rough and Ted. Back we go to the 10th, Hovland, Morikawa short. Yeah, he's got the advantage here if he can hit the green. Oh, he's asking for it to cut. Is it coming back on? Is it coming back on? Is it? That's a great shot. You can see why he was wanting just to let it a little bit of cut, and then it would have took this. And then it goes, birdie two. Another putt to come for Thomas still. So we go to 10. Colin Morikawa just short of the green here. You can see the elevation changes on this hole. He can't actually see where he's going to land it, so he's going to have to kind of visualize it. He's going high. Clipped it really nice. Hoping for that check, and it gets it. It's a great shot Colin Morikawa. We'll see in a moment. Putting down the hill for birdie and to win the hole, Hovland at 10. He's only got to touch this. He's only got to get it going. Such a quick putt. He hardly touched that at all. Yep, that's a good putt. That's a good putt. Morikawa, I don't think it's been given. Back to 10. This for a good one, though, for Morikawa from where he was. Great up and down for Morikawa. He's too down. He's not playing that bad. He's just playing against an absolute monster in Victor Hovland today. He's going to have to do something miraculous here on the back nine. Morikawa is short of the green. We're here at 11. Hovland also going for it. There'll be some recoil here. My goodness, he hit that hard. Oh, tried to hop up on that front left edge. Too much of a divot here. You're just going to see a splash of that sand kind of jumping in the air. He's going to use all bounce. Kind of heard that. He kind of sounded a little heavy there, and, and the shot kind of showed that he landed it much shorter than he was. Victor Hovland, Oklahoma State Cowboy. Heck of a shot, about 320 yards. Up and over, rolling up and left and right. Just short. Boy, his touch, is, there's a lot of mounds, a lot of rolling hills, and his touch around the greens has been absolutely incredible. This to tie the hole, Morikawa at 11. With Hovland in for a three. Big putt here. Feels like he's got to have it. Just falls three down to 11. I mean, you're going to run out of holes really quickly when you make the turn. 
three up. That feels like a huge lead. You can see just ahead on the right. Now I think he's wondering, is this going to stay? Oh, lovely nudge. One of, one of Justin Thomas, he's nudges there. And off the cush, beautiful shot. To extend, he's three up now, back to Hovland. Victor here, two putts to win the hole. Just all about the pace. Oh, he's run that one a little bit past. Tough putt up and over the slope. Is to win the hole with a birdie, Hovland, to go four up in this match against Colin Morikawa. He had trouble with his second. And up he goes. Hovland, four up on Morikawa. Tough bend back left. Four up. Just likes it, I think. Oh, it's gorgeous. Beautiful shot. To retain his Morikawa's reply at 13. He hasn't really played that bad today. Over to 13 once again. Victor Hovland for the win. This is to go five up on Morikawa. <laughs> As we go to Morikawa at 13 for birdie. Hovland a good bit nearer. This is a must putt for him. Four down. Five up. Could come too shortly. Arakawa to tie the hole at 13 to remain four down with five holes to play. <laughs> Just about enough <laughs> of the left side of the hole. 14 Hovland in the second match, four up on Morikawa. Looks anxious, heading down the left. 14th green, a birdie part here, and for the win for Morikawa, he needs it. About 40 feet up and over a mound, he saw there. Oh, wow! Come on, Morikawa! Just pours it in. I feel like he was due all day. He's played so well, he's played so solid. And I thought Victor was just going to steal another one there from that pitch shot. Colin pours it in. Colin thinking from the fairway, I'm just going to hit the middle of the green, play safe, he's in trouble. Well, he gets out of trouble, and look at that putt. Boy, that was beautiful. It's the beauty of match play. Driver, Colin likes to fade it, so this hole kind of, kind of suits up well for him. Trying to go down the left side right there, try to fade it back, but it's fading too much. He's watching it closely. Oh, carries that first bunker. Now he's in between them. You're just, you're just crossing your fingers right now, hoping you get a lie. Pin that middle left. It's going to be hard to hit it. Victor is kind of patting it. I'm going to aim a little right. Kind of pull cut back. This one kind of drove. I bet he hit it off the toe a little bit. Yeah, I think he kind of hit just a little off the toe. That's why I kind of drew a little bit in carries usually. His usual. into the 15th. He's going to hang on. Stay there. It's just okay. Now Morikawa, this is his second up the hill. 15, three down. So thick, just didn't get it. Won't get up the hill. Come all the way back down. Oh, it may just stay there. Well, up out there today. Key moment for Colin Morikawa at the 15th to continue the match. He's got to hold this one. Otherwise, the first point of today will go to the Europeans.
and they will move to 11 and a half points and within three of their victory total. Back and through. So good, put so much pressure on Carl. Carl played really solid today. Just could not get any momentum. Congratulations to Victor. Enjoy it. To watch another Ryder Cup video, click here and subscribe here.